Do you want to know how to create a free website without having to use a credit card and also where the web host doesn't show ads on your website? A free website can help you publish your images, music, or videos and also help you gain new customers. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can create a website for free with Pro free host. But first, if you are new to this channel, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification button so that you will get notified whenever we publish videos like this. Now, let's get started. Where do you get free hosting? To get the free hosting, you need to go to this website, profreehost.com. I leave a link in the description below so that you can get in, get here easily. So just click on the link and will direct you into this page. So let's start with what you get with free hosting from Pro free host. With the free hosting package, you'll be able to get a limited disk space. You'll also get a limited bandwidth, meaning that you can get as many hits per day as possible. You'll also get MySQL database. You have a control panel, you have a website builder, and it is 100% free, meaning you'll have to incur zero costs, and there are no hidden costs. Then you'll get a subdomain. You'll also get 99.9 .9 uptime, that's what they can guarantee, and there are no forced ads. So to get your hosting, you just need to click to click on register now and direct you here whereby you are supposed to create an account and log in if you already have an account. So let me create an account here. I just type in my password and use the suggested password. Then I'll cl click on here. Click on that tick. An email has been sent. So what you can do is go to our email and activate our account. So let me go to my email and check. Here is the email from Profriost, what you need to do is just click on activate now and if you have not found the email on your inbox you can just go to the spam folder and check if, it is, if it's there and if not you can go back to Profriost and click on recent email because you can resend the email so what you need to do is click on activate and it'll open on a new tab next you need to create an account so to create an account just come here on this blue button here and click on click on it and it will direct you to this page whereby you are supposed to create an account. You create an account by providing your subdomain. So let me type in my subdomain here. So that is ENM Tutorials. And then I select my domain extension. So I can go with the live blog 365. I can go with Nox.com. So let me just go with the first one that is the live blog 365.com. And then click on the tick here. I have to wait for my account to be created. So next, what I'll do is click on manage and this one will direct us to this page whereby we find our details. We also have the FTP details here, the username and the password. And we also have our DNA that is the server details. So now click on the control panel and it direct you to the control panel. So let's wait until it directs us to the control panel. So it says that uh, the information we are about to submit is not secure. So let us just uh, and direct you and it direct us here whereby you are supposed to approve this or your account will be closed in case you disapprove so let's go ahead and approve and here we are directed to the c panel right here you can find your free plan you are the details of your free plan let's now install wordpress to our website so to install wordpress to our website we just need to find the softaculous app installer and it's supposed to be in the software section so here we are in the software section so we find the softaculous app installer here so just click on the Softaculous app installer. This is where the Softaculous app installer directs us. Here you find all scripts you can use to build a website from WordPress, Joomla, and so on. So let us just click on install WordPress because this tutorial is about WordPress. And from here we choose where we want to install our WordPress. So I just leave every detail as it is. All I just had is the admin. I'll leave the site name as my blog, site description and so on and if you want to create a multi-site you can just click on multi-site here and then you will have if you want to change your language you can change here if you want to install plugins from here you can do so if you want to install a theme you can also do so but we are going to do i'm going to show you how to do that from the wordpress itself so let us just click on install and we finish installing so we wait for this to install and as it installs i want you to take this time to hit the subscribe button and turn on notifications so that you can be receiving tutorials like this we have already installed our wordpress what we can do next is we can go to the front end and see what's there so let us just open this one on a new tab and see what we have so this is our website a blog about philosophy that's our website and it looks like it to be tagly so you can just go ahead and log in 
So I'll just go back and click on the link and to direct me to login or I can just come here and then I add w, wp dash admin and it will direct me to the back end of my website. You can see it directs me to the back end and the other one also directed me to the back end. So the first thing we can do is change the appearance and to change the appearance we have to install a theme. We have to install a theme and one of the best theme to install is the cadence theme so what we can do is click on hard new we can click the add new here button here or just the plus button here let me click on the plus button here and i'll come here and search cadence cadence is the first one here so i just click on install and guys you can install anything you want it's not just cadence whichever theme you want depending on the website you want to build you can go ahead and install any of it after installing click on activate and let us preview our site and see how it looks like you can see our site has changed a little bit more beautiful so let us now import demo content so we are going to install the cadence starter templates so i'm already installing the cadence starter templates it's installed and activated and it directs us to the library in the library section you can choose whether you want the good gutenberg templates or the elementor templates so let me choose elementor templates so let me scroll down find our free one Let's just install this one. So I'll click on it. From here you can see we, from here we can change the color. So let me just change the color to that one. And from here you also need to install the Elementor Pro. And from here you can change the font and down here you can see the required plugin. So we require the Elementor plugin and you can import as a single page or as a full site. So let me import as a full site. I'll click import as a full site and then I'll skip and start importing and wait for it to import the content we have successfully imported our site so let us just go ahead and view our site so we can click on view our site here or i can just go to this page and refresh and i'll see how the page looks like so you can see that the style has changed this is my blog it looks a little bit better now a little bit beautiful and if i just scroll down you realize that uh, everything looks better now so that's how you can create a free website with Profrios, I've showed you how to install WordPress, how to import demo content, and also how to install a theme. If you find it challenging to create a free website with Profrios, I leave a link in the description below for the playlist on how to create free website with a free domain. So go ahead and check it out. And also, if you found value in this video, then I'd appreciate if you hit the like button, share this video, subscribe to this channel, and turn on notifications so that you can keep getting high quality reviews and tutorials on software like this in the meantime stay safe